This is the guitar lesson for Foster the People Pumped Up Kicks from GuitarMadeEasy.com. First thing you want to do, guys, is make sure that your guitar is in standard E tuning. Next, take your capo and put it on the first fret, like so. And lastly, before we begin, please subscribe to my channel for the latest tutorials, updates, lessons, and it's a simple way of showing you enjoy my videos. So please, please, please subscribe. And don't forget to grab my free gift to you, which is my secret guitar tips. I'm just going to put that link right up there for you. Check them out. They'll get you really good, really fast. I love this song because it sounds so awesome when you play it on acoustic guitar. Only two parts you got to know, guys. You got to know the bass line, which we're going to play on our acoustic guitar. And I'll also show you how to make it sound like a bass line instead of an acoustic guitar. And you got to know the chorus. So the first part, the bass line goes like this. doing there was I start on this E string and I want to pluck that open and then I'm going to fret the second fret on the E string now the third fret on the E string and I pluck that three times now I want to do a hammer on onto the second fret on the A string and I'm gonna pluck the D string and then I want to pluck it a couple more times all together we have this Now I'm going to pluck the 2nd fret on the A string, now open, 3 times, and now I'm going to do a little, sometimes I pluck both notes, sometimes I do a hammer on. This is on the E string at the 2nd and 3rd fret, I go, so 2nd fret, 3rd fret, so 2nd fret, 3rd fret, and then open, E string. All together we have this. I'll play it very slow for you. Really not too complicated. A good exercise to practice too. I know a lot of you guys are going to be like, oh my gosh, you got to send me the tab. I need to learn this. Help! But you'll actually make yourself a better guitarist if you listen to the notes I'm playing and look at your guitar and figure it out by sound. Don't watch the video, play the video, listen to it, and figure out those notes by just using the sound. Now how we make that lick sound like a bass guitar is we palm mute it. Here's what it sounds like if you don't palm mute it. Now if we palm mute it, Hear the difference? All I was doing was I was resting this part of my palm on the strings. So when I pluck the strings, they sound a little bit muffled. Now the next part, the last part, the super easy part of the song is the chorus, which all we do for the chorus is just strum through a few basic chords. It's gonna be E minor, G, D, A, and it sounds like this. pattern I use is this. So down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up. And that's it. That's the whole song. The only other thing you got to know how to do is whistle. <laughs> Who am I kidding? I suck at whistling. <laughs> Anyways, I hope you like it. Subscribe. I will see you on the next guitar lesson. Thanks. Thanks for watching my videos, guys. Make sure to subscribe and also spread the word about Guitar Made Easy via social media. Sign up for my free email list now and I'll send you my top secret guitar tips absolutely free. 
These tips will motivate you, keep you interested in guitar playing, and will help you become a better guitarist overall. But wait, if you sign up right now, I'll throw in all this stuff and it's all for free. All you have to do is go to signup.guitarmadeeasy.com and sign up to kickstart your guitar playing. And last, if you like my videos, you'll love the way I can teach you guitar. Please go to teachmeguitar.guitarmadeeasy.com where learning the guitar has never been easier. Thanks for watching everyone and keep rocking.